But first, we have a pair of heavyweights who are also making their debuts here in Las Vegas, stepping to the power slap table for the very first time. After watching his buddy A.J. Hintz ascend to the top of the light heavyweight division, Cameron Bates decided to try his hand in his hand in power slap. And tonight, he makes his debut against Colton Cole. Here is Colton the Truth. Cole got the call on short notice while he was at work about a week ago. And uh, kind of a cool place to work considering he owns it, Charlie. Uh, yeah, Dan, I was absolutely starving when we got done talking to Colton yesterday because everybody, he is the owner and chef of Cole's Hearth Room in Palmyra, Missouri. His specialties include everything from steaks to seafood to pasta. And Dan, you specifically told me to go check out the menu. I did. I'm going with the crab cakes and the lobster tail. Uh, the, the restaurant opened in 2020. They are already getting ready to expand ahead of schedule. But also, he's the dad of two sons, his four-year-old Gunner and six-month-old Gavin. And Gunner looks up to his dad and always tells Colton he wants to go fight the guy in the garage. Now, the guy being the bob bag that Colton bought to train with. So that's a pretty cute story. Now, listen, that's all well and good, Charlie. But let's get to the good stuff. The man has had 12 professional mixed martial arts contest for sport and strike force Badaloo versus Henderson back in the day on top of that went to college on a track scholarship doing the discus and the discus if you look at it is like slapping somebody so he's done it at a high level at a college level the man is classically trained in mixed martial arts and throwing discuses you could not have a better background I want to see, though, if he's got the ingredients to be a champion. Oh, look at you. Oh, you just tie it all come together on, come and on. put a beautiful little button on you it know. at the end. He said he wants to compete. He wants to be on the big stage. Doesn't have the time to train in MMA. So he's here in power style. Young Camo World, Cameron Bates, 25 years old from Madison, Wisconsin. He won the toss, so he will slap first. Those AJ Hints and Dorian Perez power slappers through the Street Beefs promotion. And when he saw AJ win a title, he said, I want in on this deal. Yeah, that's right. You know, and AJ Hints is kind of like a bit of mentor to him as well, kind of. You know, walking him through it, showing him the ropes, things like that. As you mentioned, the street beefs, you know, he has had some professional mixed martial arts as well. And he actually showed us a video the other day. He said, listen, I can take shots. He said, look at this. And he showed us a video of some like kind of, let's just say a low level mixed martial arts promotion. It was out in the middle of a, a field, you know, dirt, dirt and mud everywhere. But the guy he was fighting was gigantic. And this guy clocked Cameron Bates, flush. And he didn't move. He took it. He took it very, very well. But you got to take it and you got to give it. So I'm excited to see what he's got. Well, we know he can take it. We know Colton can deliver it. I guess we have to wait and see if Colton can take it as well. Time now to take a look at the tail of the tape. Cole, nine years, Bates senior, one inch taller. And it is Bates with the one inch reach advantage. Let's send it to. Our Octagon announcer, Justin Bernard. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is three rounds in the Power Slap Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, in the blue corner, he stands six feet, one inches tall, weighing in at 217 pounds. Out of Hannibal, Missouri, Colton, the truth, Cole. Let's go, man. Got this. And in the red corner, he stands six feet tall, weighing in at 214 and one half pounds. Out of Madison, Wisconsin, Cameron Camel World Beats. And when the action begins, your referee in charge, Kerry Hatley. Winner of the coin toss and striking first, Cameron Bates. All right, so the 25-year-old Bates will strike first after winning the coin toss. And as we said earlier, 19% of the coin toss winners end up winning in the first round. 19% of the time, it works every time. There you go. Okay, yeah, you're really good at math. And really good. <laughs> right hand on three, you, babe. Right Let's hand go, on baby. three. You must measure. Measure. Yeah. 
One. He gets low. He gets low. Two. He gets down. Oh! But mm. Colton Cole stays up. It looked like he turned his head just a wee bit early. Kind of a slow walk back there to the chuck. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was blatant. Yeah. No doubt about that. That was a flinch. Come on, mate. Foul. All right, there it is. Flinching on blue. Flinching on blue. That's a warning. Oh, look, look, look at Cameron. Warning. He is buzzing. Okay, he gets a free go. shot. It was a warning. Let's go, man. Well, hold on. What do you mean a warning? Oh, so he gets to hit him again, but, but he doesn't get a point taken. Yeah, who cares about the points? Well, the points are important. No, they are. But if you're Bates, you just want to slap okay, him. Okay, right hand on three. Okay. Right hand on three. He Let's was measure. a little wobbly. Measure. He's too far away. Yeah, I think he needs to take a little step. That's closer. better. Okay. All right. One. Two. Oh! Oh! That's oh! it! What a shot! Three. Oh, yes. I'm not surprised it popped up. Yeah, I'll tell you what, though. Look at this. Colton Seven. Cole. He's back. He's that back in the good. game, baby. See? Okay. I, got I thought foul he was done. On red, stepping. Oh wow! One point oh, he's, red. He's wobbling stepping. going back to the chalk. Oh. One point red, stepping. Oh, stepping. One point red, stepping. What a reversal of fortune! Can you believe this? The drama. I tell you what, though, Colton Cole is not in a good way. But let's have a look. <laughs> it's a tough one. Oh, no, that's no, not, that's not, step. that's not. It was so, so slow motion at first. I'm like, that's a little step. Yeah, but then there was But a then it turns step. into, like, a step. Yeah, yeah. He was walking to the mall, the Blasio on that. Hello. And then you're going to come back, and then you're going to land another It was pretty incredible. I talk about the reversal of fortune, and he... I mean, I chased it, chased it, the knockout. It looked for a minute like Colton Cole would have the point deduction, but he got the warning, ate the next slap. Okay. So clean slap here, and... Got to stick he's in to good the shape. rules. But I'll tell you what, he's still a little wobbly. He, he would do himself a favor by taking yeah. every second um, on his clock to recover. He just almost fell backwards. From this angle here, you probably can't see it on TV, but as he stepped backwards, he was shaking. Now the doctor's coming in for a good look. <laughs> Is that you okay? Is that, yeah, you. How are the kids? Yeah, they're all right. Wife's driving me crazy, but, you know, what's new? Okay. All right, recovered. Let's go. All right, here we go. Fires. Talking to Coach Brian DeBell, the new heavyweight ah! champion. DeBell. All right, let's see what Colton Cole has. You talked Go about right the experience okay, in blue. MMA. Right on three. He's fought some he pretty good measure. guys. Yeah. Measure. But more importantly, the track scholarship specializing yeah. in discus. Two. Get ready. Oh. Ooh. Oh! Oh! Look at this guy! Oh. That was weak. That Maybe. was weak. Maybe a little more bark than bite. Are you following? Are you picking up on putting down? No, no, I, I really am. I mean, he talked a good game, but the slap was lame. I don't know if it was lame. That was lame. Come on, man. That was a bad slap. Good. Look at look, <laughs> look at Cameron. That is not the reaction yeah, yeah. you want to see uh, from uh, an opponent when you've just taken your best shot. Now. It was his first slap ever in competition. Back to the kitchen. First slap ever in competition. Get back to the okay. kitchen. Hand if you're going to show up like that, it's not even worth the Right hand on, three, right hand on three. Chef That'd Colton Cole. Medical. Getting ready to eat his third shot here from Cameron Bates. Well, revenge is a dish best served cold. One. Two. Foul. He took that one. No. He, blue. he flinched again. He tucked the chin, Good. and then he tried to roll with it early again. Blue. Remember the MMA background flinching. here? A lot of one fighters talk blue. about trying flinching. to roll. If you roll too one early, it's an blue. easy flinch. Look at it. Well, yeah, no, you're right. When you see it in slow motion, because it goes against your natural instincts, especially when you're trained. You're because he has good. had, yeah. as we said, okay. 12 good. professional mixed yeah. martial arts yeah. training. Yeah. Yeah. Just going to keep it. All right, so he's going to lose a point here. Remember, he already got a warning. And... And he gets two for flinching. Okay. Right hand on three. Yeah, the that's your measure. Take over. This is the One. fourth slap he's taken, and we're in the second two. round. Yeah! Oh, that was heavy. That was a good shot. Yeah. That, uh... 
So he can't flinch again. Remember, if you have three flinches, you're disqualified. Hey. He has a minute. You good? He, yeah, he flinched again. It was it was not as bad as the others. Uh, no, I feel. I mean, all jokes aside, I was messing around before. Colton is a great guy. Came in with a lot of experience from mixed martial arts. A great athlete as well. Okay, he's taking blue. some Hand heavy count. shots right here, though. Three. Right three. Right, he's, he's not helping himself. Measure. I'd like to see him take a little step One. forward, but it's too late now. Two. Oh, oh that's it. Sleeps him. He three. connected. Four. Oh. Five. Uh oh, that's, no, it. that's, that's it. it. Seven. I don't know if he's going to make it up. Eight. All that. That's it. We're All done. That. It's over. What a Shit comeback talk. for Colton Cole. Bites him in the ass. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, he is. Have a seat in the chair. Have a seat in the chair. He needs to sit down. Hey, talk about revenge, though. Best serve, Cole. That's what I said. Tonight's Monster Knockouts brought to you by Monster Energy. Unleash the Beast. Colton Cole, the chef, the restaurant owner, showing some sportsmanship. He was slapped twice in two rounds and then comes back with the KO strike right here, right on the butt. And that's going to feel good because, you know, he did come in with experience. He came in with confidence and certainly with the, the uh, you know, the, 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 the accolades that you need to be good at this. But it wasn't going well. He made some mistakes. He was flinching. He was wobbled a couple of times. And on the flip side, Cameron Bates, he was starting to show ball. He was starting to mock him, taunt him, all the rest of it. But when it counted, pulled it out of the bag, gets the knockout. Welcome to Power Slap. Colton, the truth, Cole. This is where I think the fighting experience really comes in handy because Colton Cole got stronger as this match went on. And one thing we didn't talk about during the fight was that discus experience. I didn't think he was going to land this shot after seeing him hit uh, land the first one. Whew. We need to not do an ultra close-up of the bellies. Yeah, I agree. When I'm doing, I'm doing well, it. You're, well, you're a lot better shape than me, but Oh, God, the diet starts Monday. I'm going to start moving closer to the table. <laughs> That's not a bad shout. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's uh, Justin Bernard to make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Kerry Hatley calls a stop to the match in round number two, declaring the winner by TKO, Colton, the truth, Cole. Colton Cole, what a comeback. Owner of Cole's Earth Room, a fine dining restaurant. The former MMA fighter, current chef, says he loves the juice. He loves how it feels to fight. And this is uh, something that he hopes to be in for a long time in here at Power Slide. Well, he's going to be happy because nothing's better than a come from behind victory, especially when you stop your opponent. As we just saw, it wasn't going well. He wasn't delivering good blows. Oh, oh goodness! Yeah. That was sickening. Three, four. That's. Damn. It did Three. sound like he was sitting him with a frying four. pan there, man. You could hear that thing next door. It sizzled like bacon. Yeah. Yeah. Let's send it to uh, Charlie with the winner now. Yeah, here with Colton Cole. Congratulations, a TKO victory. I've got to say, you looked like you were in trouble the first couple rounds, but did you have any doubt in your mind you were going to make a comeback like that? No, I was fine. I just didn't know that I was, like, moving. I was kind of frustrated on that. Was that something that you had trained for, practiced for? I know you have an MMA background. It seems like mm -hmm. that instinct kind of kicked in. Yeah, I, I knew uh, when I, I guess I turned my head on one. And I didn't know it. And then he, I just let him just give it to me. And then at that moment, I was like, all right, this guy shut the lights out because, you know, you can't sit here and just take these, you know. So what, what felt different, you know, when you had that finish versus your other slaps? Because this one was by far the most powerful and clearly it earned you the win. It was clean. It was, I was trying to, it was me trying to get my shoulders. I wanted to really explode through that. And uh, the first couple, I kind of just came up, didn't even really hit with my hand. Well, Mr. Chef, now that you got the victory, what's on the menu for tonight? Um, I, I don't know. I'm going to eat a burger. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fat. I'm just gonna... Can't go wrong with a burger. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to do that.
drink some beer. Call it. Awesome. Well, congratulations. Guys, back to you.